Hi, and welcome back to Spotlight. I'm your host, Jessica Stilley. Today we have with us our culinary arts teacher here at Cleveland High School, Ms. Pope. Hi, how are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm good. Um, so why don't we start off by having you tell us a little bit about where you trained and went to school. I trained at La Cordon Bleu. I went to their college here in Austin, Texas, and that is where I graduated from. Okay, so what made you want to um, teach culinary arts? Well, in the restaurant industry, I was a general manager for uh, many years, and one of my main job duties was to train my staff to be successful on a daily basis, and I absolutely love cooking and culinary arts, and I thought to myself, well, if I could combine the two in teaching and culinary arts, I would have a dream job. Cool. So um, what kind of things do you teach your students in your classes? Um, anywhere from basic knife skills to teamwork uh, to sanitation and cleanliness and any skill that you would need in order to be successful in the industry. Okay. So um, what are some of the things that your students have prepared so far in your classes? Uh, we've done things from Caesar dressing from scratch, even using the anchovies, to mayonnaise emulsification from scratch. We've even done basics like cookies and omelets. Preparing our fundraisers was a big deal, which we did a lot of baking for that. Mm -hmm. So um, I understand that you teach other classes rather than just culinary arts. What do you teach in those classes and what are they? I have restaurant management, which is the fundamentals of running a restaurant, how to make sure that your guests leave happy and that you're profitable, and anything that would just make you successful in the restaurant to where they could leave that class and go get a job at a restaurant and know the basics of why everything is done. Sounds like a pretty cool class. Mm -hmm. So um, what all got you your start in the food industry? Well, I um, absolutely loved cooking as a uh, child and I thoroughly enjoyed my home economics classes and I, I honestly think that if it wasn't for me having that class in um, high school I wouldn't be where I am today so I absolutely love food. So um, do you see yourself doing what you do now teaching culinary arts still being in the food industry for many more years? I do. Um, I've had uh, many conversations with Mr. McGee and finding out you know ways to expand the program and to make it um, you know, where I want it to be. So I see myself being here in Cleveland and in the, in the industry for a while. Cool. So um, you went to Skills mm -hmm. this year and competed at the district comp competition. So tell me a little bit about that. Well, we took a total of seven cakes. Um, there was actually nine students because a couple students worked as partners on their cakes. And um, out of those seven cakes, six won. And um, in fact, one of them was yours. <laughs> and you receive Best of Show. And then we also had four students go and compete in the uh, culinary arts skills portion where they had to go and actually cook in front of judges. And Luis Sanchez placed third, and he is advancing to state as well. So a total of uh, six cakes made it, and Luis winning third. So we've got a good amount going to state. I'm super excited for state too. I so too. Um, thank you for joining us today. It was really a pleasure. And I'm Jessica. See you next time on Spotlight.